Guys, today Naka is 16 weeks. Almost 16 weeks. Yeah. Guys, listen to Naka's dream and let us know what you think it means. Yeah. Mate, I had a dream. Okay, so the other day I had a dream because you guys know I've always wanted a daughter first. I've said in multiple videos, like, you know, like I really want a daughter first. And then the other day I prayed, I was like, God, am I having a boy or a girl? This is crazy. Listen I had this. a dream, mate. It was a boy. And then I was like, wait, wait, God, let me just confirm. And I was like, God, if, like, this was like two nights after I had a dream that I had a boy. And I remember I told you, right? And two nights later, I was like, you know what, God, if it's really a boy, like, confirm it again. I had another dream. I had a baby boy, mate. She saw our unborn child, guys. I saw guys. him, mate. She said he was in the living room and he had a full set of hair. It made, it looks like a wig that he had on. I was like, damn, this baby got... Luscious, <laughs> luscious hair, guys. It didn't look luscious. It just looked like a lot of hair. And he was luscious. very, like, long. And he was just... Yeah, he's very cute. He's wearing all mm. white. And it was a boy. Healthy baby. But I'm going to ask to confirm for a third time, guys. Guys, yeah, <laughs> this one... Well, yeah, our friend told us a way that we can actually do a baby registry a baby registry online mm -hmm. at one of the store and then basically the stuff gets sent to the store so then we can just go to the store and pick it up yeah. so we're gonna get information about that yeah because my mom's um, been wanting to send me stuff yeah. for the baby we've had a lot of people so. and they're like we we need to send you stuff yeah, we want so. to send you stuff so we're gonna check out information about it <laughs> and we're gonna see so we're on the way there catch you guys right there <laughs> Guys, look at all these cute little dresses. Okay, okay. Heavy. They're thick, eh? Oh, this one isn't, but look at this. Guys, what's this? This this is bigger than my bed. Right? This is a king size crib, is what yeah. it's called. <laughs> this is huge. It's nice. Okay. You, this can you bring it down? Yeah, eh? Guys, so they have this one here, and it comes with all three things. And this one is sturdy. Look. Yeah, on the side too. This one's a lot sturdier. You see that? It doesn't really move as much as the other ones. These ones have but better quality. One, it doesn't. What's this? Is this net really necessary? I don't know. Are we in Bali? <laughs> <laughs> What's this net for? Like, if it's in the home, why you need this? Mosquitoes. Guys, let me know. I'm not trying to be disrespectful. I'm just generally curious. Like, what what's going on here? Yeah, why is? Because some a lot of them have them. Yeah. So, like this one doesn't, you know? But this one has it. So, like, I don't understand. Is this like to go camping? Like, we're gonna go camping on Baby Sesame? This camp- Oh, I think that's actually what it is. Maybe it is actually for camping. Yeah, makes sense. Guys, this is what I'm talking about. This is nice. Okay. Guys, this is a nicer bed than I have all my high childhood. <laughs> Yo, they got good stuff here. Yeah. Huh. And a little table here too. Okay. I, I, I actually really like this. This could yeah. fit right beside the bed too. Just enough space. Wait, we're not getting this for Sesame. No? What do you mean? Get a little, some little shack to put. <laughs> <laughs> we found the spot. I think it's right here. But this is a problem you encounter oftentimes is that <laughs> when they go for lunch or they, they leave, you uh, you just gotta wait and come back, I guess. But uh, I think we did find it. So we're gonna try do some research, maybe set it up. Okay. Yeah, I think it's right here. Yeah. Oh. We decided just to leave because uh, we don't want to wait for an hour. There. But uh, it's nice to know they... There's professional me. There's hmm. two desks. They should have someone there when they do the rotation. Yeah. But anyways, uh, it's good to have information. We know we can just come back for it. But we gotta get ready. For our date night wait. No date night tonight. It's been a while. It's gonna be a nice little romantic date night. Yeah, yeah. But catch you guys there. Okay, me. I see you. Clean the kitchen, oh, take out the garbage. So, yeah, take a little break, you know? Take a little break. <sighs> yeah, what are you doing, mate? What am I doing? Yeah, I was in the community. I got caught off guard. Someone actually asked me, like, how I was doing. I was like, oh, guys, there's some amazing people in our community. Mm -hmm. Highly recommend. Like, if you just need, you know, lift me up, you're going through something, you need mm -hmm. a little motivation, you know, you're not a mom, you want to be a mom, you're trying to conceive. There's so much people in this group. If you want to travel, you want some tips, some cooking tips, anything like that, guys. Highly recommend you join the community. There's some, I was blown away by the amount of amazing people that there are like genuinely, you know, that have so much experience and like so much knowledge and that are going through like real life things and 
you know, we're just all here to lift each other up and positive, which is amazing. So highly recommend it. Click the link in the description, guys. And we're going to see you guys there. But yeah, anyways. Uh, Let me show you guys Sesame's room. Yeah, actually, yeah, that was a good point, too. So. <laughs> um, I had vision, you know, so you guys were at the store with us and you know the size of the things, you know, mm -hmm. so we are measuring kind of where it's supposed to be. This, we're going to get rid of it. Mm -hmm. This, we're going to put it in the living room. Mm -hmm. So we have all this space here and yeah, it's look perfect how... because it's right beside, yo, don't, don't mind, don't mind the pillows. Guys. That's dumb. Oh yeah. Our bed is like a bunch of pillows. It's comfy though. Anyways. We're talking like the bed takes like 80% of the room. Yeah. But yeah, so we're going to have it right beside the bed. And Naka's gonna sleep on this side, so it's very close to her, you know. And then this we're gonna move. And then this is usually the office, but I might buy like another desk to put in the living room. Mm -hmm. And this could be like a the little changing change. station. Naka was saying changing station, right? So she knows what's best. So if she says it can be done here. And then once Sesame's here. born, this area outside here, right here, me. Once Sesame's born, this is where I breastfeed early in the morning. Uh, before Sesame comes, we're gonna have to rate it up because I know it's crazy. <laughs> then we breastfeed my baby here, watch the sunrise. Okay, you're I gonna watch a nice view. Sunrise or sunset? Sunset. Yeah. Sunset's right here. You get the sunrise, but you get all the light though. Everything yeah. kind of goes orange. It's First light. It's so beautiful at 6 a.m., like 5, 6 a.m. here when the light hits the trees and the golf course. You may ask, how I, why am I up at 5 or 6 a.m.? Well, Sesame likes to wake me up every two hours. <laughs> Guys, ever since that night was pregnant, we've been early risers, literally yeah. up at 7, 6, 7, 8 a.m. I wake up at 3. Oh, you wake up at 3, then go back to bed at 5, yeah. and then go back to bed, and then 6. I wake up at 7. Yeah. I wake up at 6, same time as you, like 5, but then go back to bed. I wake up, I get out of bed 7 or 8, though. Mm -hmm. It's been like so, that for a couple months. Yeah, like 5 months. Those now. who know me, I told my cousin, and he was like, Yo, that's big for you. We're, we're both up in the community at 7 in the morning. Yeah. And it's, it's been a blast, guys. We've been even having some birds here, like right on the uh, balcony here. And they've just been out here. Um, they've just been there chilling. It's and then singing. It's beautiful, but they poo. So I've been fighting mm. them. They do poo. Yeah, that's so, the only downfall. That's the only downfall. But I'm so excited. Like, this is, this you see me? You see me? Why I fight every day? Let's get out of here. Even, even right here, if you sit on the chair, you can actually see the nice view from here too. Yeah, but am I gonna... That's what I was telling Dominic. Dominic wants to get rid of this chair, but I feel like I'm gonna need a chair when I breastfeed. Oh, yeah. Yeah, we, we, you can still leave it there, actually. Like, if we get rid of this, yeah. and then you put the crib, playpen, or like bassinet or whatever, like right here, there's still like enough room yeah. if we just push it. Like, look, if you just get off for a sec. Mm -hmm. Push it like here. Kind of like this. this. There's still not room. This a lot of room frame, here. This it's not the most comfortable for the back yeah. here, so I can't do it in bed. And I don't like to put my butt where I put my 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 face. Trying to get some pink on. Yeah, like, <laughs> I ain't about that. So. And I mean, we can also move it here too, right? There's a lot of room here. So this, if you move it here, there's still a lot of room. This is actually a lot more room than we thought mm -hmm. when we were first looking. So yeah, it's like very spacious. Mm -hmm. I like it. So this is gonna be Sesame's corner. In the closet, we're gonna get rid of a lot of our clothes and make room for Sesame. Mm, we have so, a couple friends that will do donations too. Yes, yes. Local friends that yes. need the clothing. Guys, you guys see that little croc right there? Huh. Better be careful playing some golf, you know? We're out here, gonna get crocked up. You see you? I see you. Guys, fun fact about these crocodiles is that apparently they stay in the sun like that after they eat because they have to be a certain temperature to digest the food in their system. So we used to think they'd be tanning, but they just digesting the food and chilling. So maybe that's why they don't eat people when they're outside like that, just chilling, the golfers, you know? Because they're refeasted. <laughs> How are you doing, Sexy Mama? Wait, I think I'm gonna order this new Indian restaurant. Eh? We have a little date night tonight. No, it's like for supper. I'm pl I plan my meals ahead of time, mate. Huh. Ooh, mate. What's wrong? Call me Big Mama. Eh? Call you pregnant, mama. Guys, we came to see our little friends here. You see that? I wonder if they like it here. Oh, okay. Hello, friend. I don't think so. <laughs> they don't... I don't know too much about turtles, but I feel like 
you get bored here? This is the whole place. Guys, we got a runner, we got a runner. Ooh. It's got track stuff. This one's just chilling, eh? Look at this one. It's just chilling. Look guys, I found baby sesame. You see him? This is me and Naka right here. Yeah. This is baby sesame. Actually guys, this is baby sesame right here. Yeah. He's trying to hide. Guys, what's going on here? Uh, excuse me, mama. Hey, what are you doing to me? Uh, what's going on? <laughs> Guys, it's getting a free ride right now. <laughs> ah. All right, guys, we just got here. We got a little passion fruit right here, you know, with the seeds. And I'm trying something new today. I got a little lychee and uh, berries. Okay, okay. It's like cranberry juice. It's oh, shoot. It's good. It's okay. It's different. Tastes mine. Yours, this one is the OG. This one is the best. I'm going to use your straw because yeah. what's yours is mine. Too good. Yeah, eh? Mm -hmm. You wish that was yours, huh? It is now. <laughs> Alright guys, Fuga here kind of already digged in a little bit, you know? Taste test. Taste test, taste test. We kind of already ate some, we kind of forgot. We were too hungry, guys, too hungry. Taste test. Okay, okay. Mmm. Mmm. This one came back home, passed out. Yeah, blacked out, you guys. <laughs> I was I feel that when she sleeps, the baby's growing. That's what I, I think. Oh, shit. I never, I never thought of that, mate. You think so? I think so. That's why, like, whenever I wake up, like, I feel like my body is different. And now my stomach starts to get itchy. I think it's getting uh, bigger. You and can't bigger. itch it, you were saying. Yeah, yeah. apparently you can't scratch it's like it. The, 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 the marks. huge, like... She woke up today and her um, ankles were a little bit swollen. Mm -hmm. Hmm. So, guys, we were supposed to find out the gender by blood work. And then we went there to the lab. And then they're like, oh, we stopped doing the gender yeah. by blood work. You have to go directly to the company. So like, oh, I guess we're just going to wait. Yeah, we have to wait 20 weeks now. They're like, oh, we can do an ultrasound? Oh, at, at 20 weeks. No, they, they said they could do it. have to wait another 20 weeks. It's no, at, no. At 20 yeah. weeks. <laughs> <laughs> no, they said they could do the ultrasound, but it's like triple the price. And, I was like, excuse me, mama. If you do it early, I'm going to wait. It's not as accurate, too. So. Yeah. Hmm. But let us know what you think that could and let us know yeah like do you guys believe in those things someone said that a lot of the times um if you dream of a gender that's the opposite god, of what god you shows you the opposite yeah. or something Ooh, wait, so you were gonna have a girl mm. can you imagine my princess every day she's gonna wear tiaras every mm. day she's gonna wear a those crown. nice dresses we saw those big today? puffy dresses people nice. gonna know sesame's in the building <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, guys, thanks for watching. Comment, subscribe. Toodaloo! We'll talk to you soon. Bye!